Hey everyone, today I'm going to show you a quick tutorial on how to use Procreate Reference Companion. Okay, let's get started. So just go up to your wrench icon and tap that. Then make sure you're on Canvas and go down to Reference and toggle that on. And you're going to see a blank screen and it's going to by default be on Canvas. So we can move this over to the top if we want, just like that. You can drag it and move it. You can also expand it using this corner or make it smaller. It's really up to you. Okay, so there's nothing on my canvas right now, so we're gonna come back to this feature in a second. Let's go to image, import image. I'm gonna use these limes. Now I'm gonna make this a little bit smaller, just like that. Okay, now I'm already working on a, drawing a little lime. So if we go to canvas, now we can see the lime on my reference canvas, just like that. And if I'm really working on a part of the lime and I need to zoom in, I can work on it right here, but also have the reference of the entire canvas at a glance, which I love, okay? And so here's my image that we already have imported. So I use that image to kind of figure out what colors I wanted for my lime. So it's really, really helpful when you're picking kind of what palette you want. I wanted something a little bit brighter than the photo. So I went with like neon lime greens. Um, but it's just really helpful because you don't have to go back and forth on your iPad for reference photos that you found. It's right here the entire time you are working on a project. Okay, so now there's this one last feature, it's called face. So we're not gonna use that right now because it works with the Procreate Face Paint tool, which is a totally different tool, and I have a tutorial on that as well that I'm working on. So for now, the important things are you can use Canvas on reference to see your entire canvas at a glance. You can use image to import an image. If you wanna clear the image, tap clear. And that's really all there is to it. And then you can tap the X to fully exit out. It's a great new feature. I'm super excited about it and I hope you guys are too. Thanks so much for watching.